Again, everybody knows this is how the story goes. She's done everything that a woman needs to get a man. Uh oh. That's how somebody feels about you, Divine Feminine. 26, 34. What is that? 36. <laughs> That's a big ass race. <laughs> Wait, can you see somebody be 2634? <laughs> Alright, hold on. Somebody loves you. And you hold the back. And you don't hold shit back. That could be tough for somebody. Maybe they're the same way. The only one built like an amethyst. Success. That's exactly how somebody sees you. Make a old man wish for younger days, yeah. <laughs> She's bringing somebody to his knees. Uh, is it because you got your boundaries up? I think the more that you resist, the more this man wants you. I feel like at first he was you know, iffy, but now he sees you as, as a complete blessing. Uh, maybe this guy was an opportunist. Yeah. Ugh. He could have spent time in jail, or he's in spiritual jail because of this. Mm -hmm. This is happiness, though. I know that if I get with this person, my whole life is different. But <sighs> there are people that, I mean, for somebody, you're married, and their family is jealous, or yours. It could be both of yours. Because this is a successful marriage, and I don't feel like they have any in their family. There's a lot of death happening, loss, a divorce. And it, this could have been quick, where it's like, okay, we met on Friday, married by Sunday. And you got people in this family group that have been together for years, and they can't get along for one day. Hmm? They, are, they went to steal something. They forged something. They could have even lied. This feels like kidnapping. I don't think this is s stealing money. What is this? The thief and the scribe. Mm, I feel like you stole this man's heart at the very least, though. He could have wrote you something, even. And, oh, man. He defended you verbally to his family I think that the family or even the, the friends that this guy hung with they kind of they liked him in low vibration we'll say but somebody even lied and said that you were in a relationship with a fire sign Yeah. Hold on. And this this guy is having a whole oh God, he's not sleeping because he found out the truth about something. Mm, from a, a detective or an investigator, he got a message from about a wife or an earth sign that this he's married, that the judgment that's that's Now it's like I'm stuck in this situation because, I mean, my pride and ego is always in check. But I had to put an end to that shit. I had to put an end to being in toxic relationships. I feel like that's what you did with this cat. You changed the player. Maybe you guys were planning on moving away. There could have even been some money that he put away for this. And I feel like whoever this detective or investigator is, is working together. I don't feel like it's for him, though. I think he's, he's working together with these other people to try to hold on to some kind of money and to get him to turn. Where is the money? Cabinet? Hold on a second. That's not what that money is. Hold on. There could even be some money buried in the backyard. 
like I'm putting this here because I want to move away and ra -da 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 -da, and I don't know what they did after that um, he's having a hard time finding it he wants to move he wants to leave I'm jealous and I know that it shows this a detective friend of his a Gemini who's who's this jealous one tell me it Tell me about the jealous one. The father. Emperor Aries. This is a father. His father loves you. His father could have even hit on you in the past. And you may have told him, like, yo, your dad. Yeah, I feel like this... I, it, this freaked you out. I don't know if you felt like um, his friends did too. It could have been the kind of thing where I don't want to start trouble. If I keep this to myself, I'm the bad guy. If I say it, I'm the bad guy. What is it do I do? And I feel like you could have told him and he didn't want to hear it. Maybe you told him to put, to like, you need... Okay, he was being closed off with you, and I think that what he needed to be closed off with them and be more open to you. His father was playing both sides, no doubt. They were doing some kind of black magic. I don't even need the cards here. I can feel it. They were doing some kind of black magic to get him to treat you the way that he should be treating or looking at the, the dad I don't know if there's a friend, everybody. It feels like there's a lot of people in on this. There's an... There's definitely a fire sign. He's got karmic parents. They're both like this. They could be aging. If, you know what it feels like? The more that they know about of all this and they're hiding it, it's aging them. The dad could be chain smoking or even smoking and doesn't normally smoke. Are these your parents? They could look rougher. They could be clones. If they look older than they usually do, but they're lying. Oh, no. Are you crying because of that? They have, oh, they have a lot of debt. Oh, boy. This was, this comes out so much about the successful marriage. This was a successful, happy marriage. I feel like this motherfucker was mesmerized. Divine feminine. Like, I can't get enough of her. And so they started talking shit. I think they, they could have even said, I feel like you were. They could have even created some kind of videos having you say something, acting like drunk and bad mouthing and just acting like, uh, I don't know, man. Um, see, he was grateful. Maybe he wasn't at the time. He wasn't grateful for the opportunity that he had with you. Uh, he still wanted to play. But now, I, I think people are starting to see the truth that this man is actually completely in love with you. And now he wants to defend you and protect you. So when the family member, if the same shit happens again, where they're, they're very good at manipulating this man. So if they say something's wrong with you, he will eventually believe it. And they know this about him. Now, if they try this again, he's going to block this out. I don't even feel like he's answering phone calls. Or maybe he's just, I don't want to hear it. I, I see what's going on. Uh, um, I got married and we were going to move away. Because you both attract wealth. Because you're both just happy people. I feel like to tell you the truth, you guys were even going to leave with nothing. Okay. So they thought, okay, got it. They thought hiding his money was going to keep him from leaving with you. And I think it got to the point where someone is so friggin' just beside themselves that they were ready, and maybe you were too, to just leave with nothing. And that's causing a tower moment. It is, because he could have had a really unhealthy attachment to money, but he dealt with this shit. And I feel like he's like, God damn it, like this, I, I, all I need is her. Yeah, I 
after that he realizes that this shit will work out for us everywhere that we go. It'll work out just because of the kind of people that we are. This one goes out to the one I love. You're the one he loves. He could have been secretly working out. And learning about money and, and manifesting and realizing that if, if I'm happy with them and we're both like this and everything is flow and, and I, well, well, I'll get this back. I occupy my time. But there's, they wanted to stop this and miss money, but now, and have a new life. He knew he was going to have a new life with you. God, they were so jealous of this man. What, what is it? Is there a business here or something? Let me find out. What, what, what is the main reason that these family members want to keep this? Tell me the main reason. Hobbling? In, they're hobbling. All right, tell me. Did your dad have a hobble? I don't know. Uh, why? Okay. Because why? They can't control him anymore. A simple, what's oh, this? Oh, cleanest. He can't even occupy his time anymore. Uh, maybe he did that with, you know what, and that's not even working. Yeah. Because they're afraid of them getting exposed. If he went to jail or did jail time, they had something to do with it. There was forgery. They were trying to push him into another relationship, but that shit's not working. Yeah, it's not working. He's trying to figure out how to end this relationship and be with this, is this is a wife? That's, or, or to be with this divine fact, because he's constantly thinking about this other woman. He's constantly thinking, how do I end this? This is the one I left behind. What's going on with the wife? What's going on with this wife or this? Who is, is she? I don't know. She could even be with his friend. Yeah, she's in a relationship with his friend anyway. So it's like, well, there's your reasoning. Thank you. I'm not angry. Just thank you. You did something for me. Now I can go do this. Yeah, and now he wants to go make it work because I feel like he had a really good work ethic before and now he's having a hard time even getting out of bed. Yeah. And he was he didn't want to admit, I'm in love. I'm in love with this woman. I mean, maybe I did treat her like an option and I, you know, I didn't take her seriously. But I tell you what, now I want to invest in this shit. Now I want to work together with this person because I'm grateful that she helped me get through this dark-ass time. Helped me on the right path. Brought out the loving, compassionate side of me. Helped me go through all of this loss. I realize now I'm going through all this loss. What is he saying? Welcome. This is the dead, uh, dead man. He's, uh, before he could have been kind of dismissing some of the shit that you were saying when you said stay to yourself. And because about attracting wealth, and he didn't though. His father, there's a father, an older man that has something to do. They could even be telling this guy, "Is this family business? This is a business with children." It seems like some of his family members were getting involved with child trafficking. He didn't want to do it. Oh, okay. He could have done, messed with... I mean, look, th there could have been a situation where he doesn't want to do it, but it's a dead man's party. Who could ask for more? What kind of song is this? I don't know if he did. I feel like they're trying to... Whatever they can do, like, there's a possibility that that he didn't get involved with this and they're saying that he did or this is the business or line of work that he's in 
let's say he was. Let's look at it from both sides. Let's say that he was and he did this. He doesn't want to do it anymore. They could be trying to say, like, oh, you know, what, what is she going to say when she finds this out? And it's Why do you want this man stuck so bad? Somebody's gonna answer, and they're gonna and they're gonna throw themselves under the bus. It's gonna be a toxic ass mother. It's gonna be because it. It's like, bitch, we didn't even say your name, darling. Rust. What is this? You are great at supporting my horrible life choices, mom and dad. As soon as I go to, to make shit right, or God forbid, I don't want to go out as much or bring hookers home or strippers home anymore. Something's wrong. What, we got to put shit in his food? What do you got to do? We got to make him feel bad about himself. Do you remember that you did this? Because there could be a situation where he played a part in something for money, or it could have been blackmail too. But uh, <clears throat> I just think it's getting to the point where it doesn't really matter what these people say. Go ahead, say this. They could even be trying to say that they can arrest him for something that had something to do with a child, but that's not even him. Appreciate. He didn't appreciate what you brought to the table. And I feel like now he's saying that you're very valuable and he needs you in his life. Be careful if someone's trying to get you locked up or saying that you're in some kind of video doing something this is what I would do. If you know that there's something special about you, you and, and you know that there's something faded or you just have a destiny, you just know something, there's nothing they can do. They will just know and believe that you will die on the way or you will get into an accident trying to do this shit to me. You'll have a heart attack. Know that shit. Think it. You don't even have to say it out loud. I don't feel like just think it, believe it. And that's a wrap. Because something is closer than, than people think or they, they know it and that they can smell it. You can spit it. They haven't showered. They're so focused on this. We're not going nowhere. Love you, Philly.